Now, Representative Mike Levin says he's worried that some of the nonprofits who were receiving money from the Shelter and Services Program through the Department of Homeland Security might get their funding cut. He says if the program is cut, many nonprofits who are helping asylum seekers will have to be reimbursed after the fact from FEMA if they're looking for federal support. I was just at the Oceanside Transit Center the other day with Interfaith and with some of our uh, local leaders. Uh, everybody's doing the very best, best that they can, but they all uh, mirrored the need for additional help, where that help comes from the county, the state, the federal government. And we are prepared to provide them with any resources that we can, with any of the 800 million that's still there from last year.